If you would like to get your hands on GTA 5 Shark Card Cash for absolutely free whenever you guys want them, click the link in the description below to appbounty.net and use code NPF for a bonus. A ton of you guys were asking me to use Zero Gravity again, but this time when we kill Trevor. Are you both just gonna float up into the sky? This mod in itself is amazing. Oh, there we go. We got Michael on the phone. Michael, he's on his way. Oh my days. This is gonna be interesting. What is gonna happen when we disable gravity? Will Trevor, will Michael, will Franklin, will the cars, will everything float off into the sky? I don't know. Will he go flying into space? Let me know in the comments section below, guys. So, three, two, one. Let's just do this. Let's disable gravity. And oh my days, I can't believe what is happening, guys. If you would like to win yourself a brand new Xbox One or PlayStation 4, then click the link in the description below to my huge giveaway. Good luck and enjoy the video. Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Nort, and today what we're going to do is something really cool. I can't wait to get into this because a few weeks ago we took a look at a zero gravity mod, but we only took a look at it once and this was seeing what would happen if we dropped Michael in zero gravity and that video was amazing. I absolutely loved filming it. You guys really enjoyed it as well. But since I made that video, a ton of you guys were asking me to use zero gravity again, but this time when we kill Trevor. So for example, when Trevor's rolling around in the fire and stuff, and when you're about to kill him, are you both just going to float up into the sky? This is just going to be amazing. So let me quickly show you guys a quick example of how this works. So let's say I'm going to get into my buffalo, and then we're going to quickly press O, and we're going to enable zero gravity. So as you can see, gravity is now on zero. Let's quickly move forward and yeah you just can't your car will float into space so this is exactly what we're gonna do today guys and I mean just just come on just come on this this mod in itself is amazing I love this mod so much can we go forward again or we're just gonna keep going into the sky that's fine you know what guys that's just totally fine with me <laughs> look at that guy <laughs> Look at that guy over there. Oh my days, he is going flying. So this mod is a ton of fun, as you can see. Oh my days. In fact, when I last used this, I actually spent like all day playing around with this. So yeah, I can imagine I'm going to play around with this a little bit more. I think I'm just going to stay here. You know, this is fine. We'll just stay in this limbo stage. I need to get some more kind of like push motion on my car to get it to go somewhere. But the base is it's just going to float up into the sky. Okay, I, I can't even get out of this. I, I can't get out of my car. I'm stuck in the car. As you can see, that's my car pretty much there, just floating in space. So <laughs> let's see what happens if we enable normal gravity. There we go. This is going to be amazing. I can't wait to get into this, guys. If you do go on to enjoy this video, though, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. It would be greatly appreciated. Let's try and smash our goal of 5,000 likes, guys. I know we can do it. And uh, let me know in the comments section below exactly what you think is going to happen. But this is going to be really interesting because I have no idea what's going to happen. What I do know, however, is that when you kill Trevor, the part where you shoot him isn't a cutscene. So you're just going to both float off into space. So this is going to be interesting. Sorry if I hit my microphone there. Yeah, let's just do this. So I'm going to get inside Franklin's house. Come on, Franklin, buddy. We've got to go and put down Trevor. We've got to do the right thing. But I wonder who's at the door. <laughs> Let's answer. Oh, it's our good friend, Devin. It's our good friend, Devin. How's it going, dude? Hey, Slick, it's me. <laughs> I find it kind of weird how Devin is like really hyperactive in this scene, but at the same time, he's being extremely psychopathic. Like this guy is just crazy on so many levels. And I'm pretty sure none of us really like him. I mean, I'm not sure about you guys. Of course, you can let me know in the comments below if you like Devin. I would love to know why you like Devin though. If you do comment that in the comments section below, but uh, I just, I don't like his character at all, guys. He's he's kind of like a bully, a really mean bully. Either way, it doesn't matter because we're going to be killing Trevor this time. Let's go for Trevor. Let's do this and let's see what happens if we kill Trevor in zero gravity. This is going to be interesting, guys. This is going to be interesting. Okay, so we need to go somewhere around about here. I believe it's like right there or something where we go and meet him. Yeah, just for fun, guys, I think what we're going to do is oh gosh we went straight over that completely overclocked that that's fine we'll take the shortcut the shortcut works i guess what we're gonna do guys is uh see what happens if we use zero gravity in the chase and if that's just too complicated and too difficult to do uh, then we'll just enable zero gravity in that final moment when we're about to shoot trevor but this is going to be interesting imagine if we were standing there and trevor was rolling around in the ground but instead we were both just floating off 
Like, I seriously think that is going to happen when we enable zero gravity. There's no reason why this wouldn't happen. It's going to be hilarious. It's going to be amazing just seeing Trevor roll around on the ground and slowly float off into space. And who knows, guys, this might actually save Trevor as well because technically... Oh gosh, okay, I'm terrible at driving, guys. In theory, this should actually save Trevor because he won't be rolling around in the gasoline anymore. He's going to be rolling around in thin air. So even if we do shoot the gasoline, how is it going to hurt Trevor whatsoever if he is just in the sky, if he's in the air, not in the gasoline at all? So this is going to be really interesting and on so many levels, I can imagine we're going to see so many different things. But I absolutely love the zero gravity mod. In fact, I might enable it soon. Yeah, I'm going to enable it now. Let's go. <laughs> We're starting to skid. Oh, my days. Oh, there we go. We're going into the sky now. So the awesome thing about this is that it doesn't just instantly ping you off into the sky. It actually treats it like there is literally no gravity. So whichever way you are going, whichever way the force is going, it will just keep your car going in that direction. I think I'm going to disable this soon enough because... <laughs> Obvious reasons, guys. <laughs> Look at that car, though. Look at that guy over there. That's insane. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we're loading it up. Trevor's on his way, guys. Trevor is on his way. The moment we load this up and the moment the chase starts, I'm then going to enable zero gravity and see what the chase is like. Like, I can imagine just Trevor, like, flying off into the sky and stuff. And there's Trevor. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, what <are> you doing? <laughs> I'm good, T. I'm good. And yourself? I'm, I'm peachy. <laughs> All right, Trevor knows what's going on. He's like half in his car because he knows. This is the part I hate as well. As much as I hate killing off Michael, when you really do think about it, Michael was the one who actually screwed over Trevor. So assassinating Trevor is kind of like betraying him twice. He really, it's, it's just, it's very heartbreaking, okay? I really hate this scene. There we go. Okay, so it's just started. The chase is on. And what we're going to do is take away gravity very, very soon. I'm going to get really, really close to him first, and then we're going to remove gravity. So this is going to be interesting, although I wouldn't mind doing this in the hills. So yeah, let's just do this, guys. All right, let's go back. This is too difficult. <laughs> this is too difficult to do. My car just went absolutely flying off the cliff. All right, we're going to try and get a bit closer to Trevor and see what happens then. The moment you enable zero gravity, your car just goes flying. It's going that fast, so much so that you can't even see what's going on around you. Oh, there we go. We've got Michael on the phone. Michael, he's on his way. Here we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, so once this cutscene is over, when he crashes in, we're going to disable gravity. Trevor has crashed into the gas tank. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. This is going to be interesting. What is going to happen when we disable gravity? Will Trevor, will Michael, will Franklin, will the cars, will everything float off into the sky? I don't know. Oh, no. Okay, so this is the part. This is the part, boys. This is the part. Oh my days, put down Trevor. So we're going to disable gravity. We're going to see what happens when we do so. Will he go flying into space? Let me know in the comments section below, guys. So, three, two, one. Let's just do this. Let's disable gravity. Okay, gravity is definitely set to zero. What's this like? Oh, Franklin's floating off. Wait, Mike, no, no. Okay, guys, I think I have to do this. I know how to do this. As you guys may have just seen there, Franklin was floating off as we were doing that. Like, just moments before, Franklin was floating off just as we were about to put down Trevor. So what we're going to do is actually use our object spooner to mess around with Trevor. And we're going to throw him into the sky in zero gravity. And he should just go flying off into space because it worked with Franklin, as you guys saw there. So it definitely has to work with Trevor. And this might actually save him. That's amazing. That's seriously amazing. So can we skip this? Come on. Don't put us through the entire credits, Rockstar. Don't do this to me. I know we can do this now. I just know we can do this. And I'm so excited to get into this. I'm so pumped. So let me just skip this. We're going to go through this as fast as possible. Kill Trevor. Come on. Just kill Trevor. Come on. Come on. Okay, Trevor's just arrived. He's just arrived. You can see it flashing on my radar. We're going to go over there now. And this is going to be amazing. This is actually going to be amazing. So let's get out of this. Let's just wait for Trevor for a minute. And let's just do this. Let's go. Here we go. We've just come off the motorway. We're almost there. Just one more corner to go around and then we can start having some fun with this mod. So come on, Trevor. Come on, buddy. There we go. There we go. He's about to hit into things. He's about to hit into the container. He's about to do this. There it is. There it is, boys. There it is. He's into it. Okay, right. This is going to be interesting. Oh my gosh. Okay, so... Right. Come on. Get past this. I hate this part so much. Franklin obviously hates this part. Like, he hates this part so much. Okay, so this is the part. So what we're going to do is set it to zero gravity. So gravity is now on zero. And we're going to choose Trevor. Oh, no. There has to be a way to do this. 
No, 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 no. So by the looks of things, you can't actually select Trevor when he's on the floor. But don't worry, guys. Don't hesitate. I've got a plan B to this. Sometimes this may happen, but there's always a plan B to this. And this plan B, just it's going to work. And in order to do this, all we're going to want to do is quickly slow down the time as much as we can do. I mean, I guess we don't have to. We don't really have to do that. You know what, guys? We're going to do it the badass way. We're not going to slow down time. We're not going to do any of that stuff. We're just going to go really, really far in front of Trevor. Now, this is going to be so difficult to do, but if we do manage to pull this off without slowing down time, you guys have to smash that thumbs up button. So, what we're going to do... Oh my gosh, it's so difficult to control. We're going to choose our soul gun. So, as you can see, we've just got our soul gun. And all we have to do is point it at Trevor. So, let me quickly get off this. Trevor should come past. There he is. There's Trevor. So what we're going to do, guys, is quickly point our gun at Trevor. <laughs> this is so difficult to do. Guys, if we do this, smash that thumbs up button. Oh, my days. Right, you know what? I'm just going to kill myself. We're going to do this again. We're doing this again. This is so difficult to do. All we have to do is shoot Trevor, and this will allow us to become him. <gasps> we did it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. How do we do this? How on earth did we just do this? All right. So we're literally playing as Trevor. So what we're going to do now, when the time is right, we're going to disable gravity and he will go flying into the sky and we won't be able to shoot him. Oh, my days. We're not like controlling him or anything. Look, I'm, I'm not controlling him. I'm not controlling him whatsoever. Trevor is just driving through the traffic. This is amazing. Can I do anything with this? Can I shoot? Oh, no, 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 <laughs> no, no. Okay, we've got to go back to Trevor again. We accidentally shot with the combat pistol. Come on, 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 no. Oh, my days. Why did I just do that? Why did I do that? That was such a stupid idea. There we go. We're back as Trevor. Okay, right. We're not using the combat pistol. We're using the vintage pistol now. We're not going to screw this up again. I wonder what happened to Franklin, though. I have no idea. Like, we're still doing this. It isn't failing the mission, so are we going to save Trevor? Like, I, I don't know. I don't know. How is Michael going to be alerted? Like, Trevor's still going into the trap, but we can't, like, do anything to this trap because Franklin is no longer following Trevor. I, I'm just, I'm so clueless right now. I'm so clueless. What is going to happen? But, I mean, more importantly, what is going to happen when we enable zero gravity? But still, what is going to happen, guys? We're calling Michael off Trevor's phone. That's something new. <laughs> I actually can't believe we did this. All right, so here we go. The cutscene's triggering. There's Michael. Franklin is, like, nowhere to be seen. Oh, my days. Trevor basically committed suicide. He just told Michael that he's uh, he's gonna, he's coming over this location. Anyway, he's on the floor. This is the moment of truth. Are we going to be part on the floor? Are we going to be still Trevor in this? I, we should be. I can't see Franklin. Where's Franklin? Where is Franklin? Where is Franklin gone? Franklin's fast. <laughs> This is amazing! This is actually amazing. Okay, so what we're gonna do is disable gravity whilst we're Trevor. Oh my days, it actually worked! We're on the floor, so let's disable gravity, zero gravity. No, this doesn't work! Let me go into this. Oh, what? This doesn't work at all, we can't! No! What? That is so weird. So, although we tried this, we even became Trevor. Even Trevor couldn't go flying into the sky. Guys, that is so weird. Oh my days. I was so hyped for this. I was so hyped for this, guys. But it looks like, unfortunately, you can't... Wait, what? What is... Trevor died. What? <laughs> what did we just do? Mission failed. Trevor... Yeah, no way. No way, dude. No... Oh my gosh. I'm so done. What? If I can make a compilation of the stupidest ways to fail a mission, this is at the top. Mission failed. Trevor died because we were meant to kill Trevor. That doesn't make sense. I'm so done. I'm so done. So, unfortunately, guys, it looks like... Wait, why is Trevor putting down Trevor? Have we saved Trevor? Have we just saved Trevor? Why is Trevor putting... What? What? What have we just done? What have we just done? We've literally just killed Trevor with Trevor. So Trevor's still alive. So technically, we've saved Trevor. What? This is so weird. This is so weird. Technically, we kind of saved Trevor. But unfortunately, if you try to do this in zero gravity, then you can't save him, unfortunately. But I was really excited to see what would happen. Like, imagine if everything around him just started floating up and stuff. That would be amazing. 
But nonetheless, I still had a load of fun recording this. And if you guys did enjoy this video as well, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. It would be greatly appreciated. Let's try and reach our goal of 5,000 likes, guys. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on anything else like this on a daily basis. And let me know in the comments section below exactly what you guys would like to see me do next. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been an awesome video to do and record. So once again, I hope you guys did enjoy it. But guys, my name is Nort. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, stay absolutely awesome. I'll see you guys in the next video.